question of the day, what types of logs are the best logs? Kellogg's! Yay! But Raj, why are they the best? Because lots, they're great. <laughs> Will Keith Kellogg and his brother, Dr. John Harvey Kellogg, were both inventors of Frosted Flakes cereal. In 1906, W.K., who lacked a formal education beyond the sixth grade, forever changed the way we eat breakfast when, we, when he discovered that a better flake was produced by using only the corn grit. He placed his signature on each package, stating that his organization's corn flakes are the original. The company's success is built around the fact that Kellogg's appeals itself to a wide population and not just consumers who are on special diets. Kellogg's has continued to improve its product line and packaging techniques, thus allowing the company to meet the needs of an ever-changing and evolving consumer base. With the arrival of pasteurization of milk, the cereal business began to exponentially expand. Kellogg's distributed free samples of his cornflakes while also following up with advertising in magazines and on billboards to ensure that consumers would continue to speak out his products. In 1914, the Kellogg Company created wax tile wrappers, which was a new concept in the packaging technology. In regards to advertising, Kellogg also held a children's art contest, selecting the best entries for use in Kellogg's advertisements. The first Kellogg premiere, the Funny Jungle Land Moving Picture Book, was distributed to consumers in 1910, along with the Kellogg's brand flakes and all brand cereals being introduced in 1915 and 1916. In the early 1920s, Kellogg continued to expand into new markets, exporting cereal to England and later building a plant in Sydney, Australia. In the United States, Kellogg introduced ready-to-eat cereals in individual servings for the use in hospitals, hotels, and real dining cars. Kellogg also established one of the first home economics departments in the food industry in 1923, which was the same year that Kellogg's Pep Wheat Flakes were introduced. Kellogg's extremely famous Rice Krispies began being introduced to consumers in 1927. In the 1960s, the company introduced five new cereals which included Kellogg's Fruit Loops, Kellogg's Apple Jacks, Kellogg's Frosted Mini Wheats. In the 1970s, the Kellogg's company also expanded into the frozen foods business with the addition of its line of Eggo brand frozen waffles. In 1980, the company came out with a new product, including Kellogg's Square Line, Kellogg's Crispix, and Kellogg's Just Right. In the 1990s, convenience foods grew as a percentage of Kellogg's sales. Kellogg's Rice Krispie Treat Squares and Kellogg's Nutrigrain Bars won broad consumer acceptance, and Kellogg's Pop-Tarts Toaster Pastries became the company's top-selling product. In 2001, the company completed the largest acquisition in its history, the $4.56 billion purchase of Keebler Foods Company, a leading producer of cookies and crackers. Cereal represented 53% of its worldwide sales, with 32% coming from snacks and the remaining 15% from other grain-based foods. The company celebrated its 100th anniversary in 2006. 2008 was Kellogg's acquisition of Bare Naked, a maker of premium, all-natural, and organic granolas, hot cereal, and trail mixes. In 2009, the company released its first global corporate responsibility report. At the company's annual meeting of share owners, Kellogg announced it would make a donation of an entire day's worth of cereal to Feeding America. Breaking news on how Kellogg's is so ethical. Billy, can you tell me a little bit more on why Kellogg's was selected by Ethisphere? Yes, I can. Their cultural compliance programs and social responsibility is at the heart of their best practices. Ethisphere found that Kellogg's excelled in various amounts of categories, which included ethics and compliance programs, corporate citizenship and responsibility, culture of ethics, governance and leadership, and innovation and reputation. According to Ethisphere, the companies that make the list understand the impact ethics has on reputation and their brand. They not only promote ethical business standards and practice, practices in, e, internally, but they also exceed legal compliance minimums and shape future industry standards by introducing best practices. Among those best practices are reinforcing the right behaviors to safeguard the, businesses, the business and its consumers, customers, investors, employees, and other stakeholders. In 2013, 
Kellogg introduced its refreshed global code of ethics to the organization, and in 2014, the company continued to embed the code into its culture. In 2014, Kellogg's announced new global sustainability goals in responsible sourcing and the conservation of natural resources. The company also continued progressing against its hunger and relief pledge to donate 1 billion servings of food through breakfast for better days. So Raj, what does the book say about ethical culture and how does Kellogg's demonstrate that? Well, Bailey, according to the book, Chapter 5, ethical culture reflects the integrity of decisions made and is a function of many factors, including corporate policies, top management's leadership of ethical issues, the influence of co-workers, and the opportunity for unethical behavior. Kellogg's Code of Ethics, called K-Values, is composed of six things. Integrity, which they say, we act with integrity and show respect. Accountability, accountability. <laughs> we are all accountable. Passion, we are passionate about our business, our brands, and our food. Humility, we have the humility and hunger to learn. Simplicity, we strive for simplicity and results. They love success. They also have a global code of ethics principle. In this, they state that our people, we act with integrity, we treat each other with fairness and respect. For their consumers, we delight our consumers with safe, high quality, great tasting food. For the marketplace, we compete vigorously and with integrity. We partner with those who demonstrate our values. For their investors, we are preferred investment because we deliver the present on creating the future and their communities. We are natural resources responsible and support our communities. All right, Kelsey, how does mm -hmm. Kellogg's ensure that they're living out their code of ethics? Well, according to their website in this excerpt, this is what they have to say. When it comes to doing the right thing, our K values are foundational. Our values are part of our DNA. They guide, it, they guide the way we work with our business partners, within our communities, and with each other. Through integri integrity, accountability, passion, humility, simplicity, and a focus on success. We have created a vibrant ethical performance culture. Living our values is Kellogg Company's global code of ethics. We gave it this name because living the K value, embodying them day to day in our decisions and actions, is essential to our individual and collective success, enabling us to achieve sustainable business success and maintaining a strong reputation. The Co contains a lot of important information as well as resources that help us conduct our business legally, ethically, responsibly, and in accordance with our values. It is readable, easy to use, and relevant to our day-to-day -day jobs. The topics in this code are organized under five major headings. Representing our stakeholder, key stakeholders, they are our people, our consumers, our marketplace, our investors, and our communities. Yay, ethics! <laughs> so Bailey, could you tell me a little bit more about what Chapter 7 from our textbook says about ethics? Yes, in fact I can. Chapter 7 of the text states that corporate culture is also the shared beliefs top man managers in a company have about how they should manage themselves and other employees and how they should conduct their business. Furthermore, it proposes two dimensions to describe organizational culture. One, concern for the people which is the organization's efforts to care for its employees' well-being. Two, concern for performance, which is the organization's efforts to focus on output and employee productivity. Kellogg's is an integrative culture since it is a company that has both high concerns for people and performance. Integrative cultures arise when the superiors recognize that employees are more than just interchangeable parts and that they have great quality. Kellogg shows high emphasis on training their employees to act ethically in and outside of the workplace. So Raj, could you tell me a little bit more about the corporate responsibility? Well, Nebraska girl, Kellogg's is a company which believes that corporate responsibility is essential to their current and future success as an organization. The company has created strategies, governance, structures, corporate policies, commitment statements, and codes of conduct that help embed corporate responsibility into their everyday operations. Furthermore, Kellogg's engages with a broad array of stakeholders to gain insights into the ideas and opinions of people outside of the organization. <coughs> According to Chapter 8 of the text, stakeholders view corporations as moral agents because corporations are chartered as citizens of the state and or nation. 
Therefore, they generally have the same rights and responsibilities as individuals. They are required to obey the law and regulations that define acceptable business conduct. Kellogg's has succeeded in doing so due to their high emphasis on conducting business ethically. Thank you. <laughs> so tell me, Kelsey, how has Kellogg's implemented their code of ethics? Sure. Kellogg's has continued to successfully implement their code of ethics through their organizational commitment to society and community, diversity and inclusion, and to military veterans and to their families. Kellogg's continues to focus on corporate citizenship and how they continue to consistently make a positive impact on their society. Feeding the Hunger has been one of the organization's core social initiatives. Kellogg's tries to help the community from food donations during times of disaster to breakfast programs for school children, providing food for those who need it. Kellogg's also places values in their employees and nurture their development while ensuring that all of them go through a consistent process and have equal opportunity for success. The company's goal is to reflect the diversity of their consumers throughout the company. <laughs> They're great! Yeah, I On reputation and their hand. Look his ass. <laughs> their hand? But I can make them see them. At least that's what people say. That's what people say. Okay, I need to say it. Can't stop, won't stop. Can you tell me why I can't walk? Yes, I can. Cultural. God dang it! <laughs> well, Kelsey, how does Kellogg's ensure that they're living on their food about? Well, according to their website, they state this about that. When it comes to, <laughs> when it comes to doing the right thing, our K values are fundamental, are foundational. <laughs> Break? <laughs> that was gonna be fun! You guys get it out! <laughs> there!